Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah and welcome again. This is Abdul Karim Blasi and you are watching Pressure Ulcer from A to Z. Last time we already described the procedures of dealing with this infected stage 4 pressure ulcer. We pass through the assessment and we come now to know the priorities of treatments that we are in need to use hydrogel for these unwanted tissues and we agreed that there is exposed bone this is on the middle this is sacrum bone and there are signs and symptoms of having infection so what you will do to deal with this infection and what are the priorities of dealing with this infected wounds last time we said about the infected wounds uh, several dressings can be applied to deal with the infected wounds as we are not here recommending and a procedure rather than what you already know about your items what you already apply in your hospitals rather than it's apart from my experience and my skills in classifying the options in dealing with infected wounds as just to start by dressings with a silver anything here with a silver can be applied but there are two issues that you should observe don't put the silver direct over the bone make a barrier make a sheet make vaseline dressing make anything that you can apply it to assure that this is not happen over of the uh, bone so let's to say that here we are using a vaseline dressing and this vaseline dressing will cover the bone for the activation of silver dressing as we discussed that we are not using the silver regardless of its type or its name as the ag alone is not making um, uh, ag alone is not making any effect of the wounds you should transfer the ag if you remember in the silver presentation to ag plus so it's recommended to make some wet over of this silver over of this silver and this silver with alginate but don't forget that to follow up the company recommendation as there are some types of silver prohibited to use normal saline in its activation and some other types of components of the silver prohibited to use ringer lactate and some other types they don't mind with any types of both now as as we take you are taking all the precautions here and you will assure that you cover all the infected area by the silver and here now you control the wound make sure that if there is no as this situation that don't make here you can make the silver out of this part but for the other part for the other part of the wounds don't make the silver to cross the wound edge make the silver only covering of this area and after that you will keep doing and treating by the silver for the required period of time and this required period of time as we said to, to keep the dressings for 14 days then a comprehensive evaluation then again another 14 days now after if you passed all of these days and still the wound is not giving you an proper healing proper enhancements what you will do and what are the other options this is what we will discuss in the coming vlog thank you very much for being with us this is abdul kareem lassi and you are watching pressure ulcer from a to z